how can I, as a small person, answer a question about the cosmos? You have a puzzle with a billion pieces, and we've got one piece. So, why are we here? The microbes that I study in hot springs are paramount to understanding where life could be in space. You were trying to solve this problem. You know, I wake up at night thinking about it. So you're a nerd too. 100% nerd too. <laughs> We can speak from very different scientific disciplines and yet speak common language. Oh my god! Oh my god. <laughs> Welcome. See if you can make a robotic hand move by your thoughts. When you're right on the edge of this big unknown, it's very hard to say where the science is going to go next. There must be things we cannot understand. What makes you willing to search after something that we don't even really it know must exists? Be there. Come on. Where do you get that, though? Everybody's dream as a scientist is to make a big discovery to truly advance the field. It's a quest for knowledge, it's a quest for understanding. Dark matter, dark energy, there's something beyond. And we don't know yet what that is. This is a tool to explore the center of the galaxy, essentially. Whoa. I think the important questions transcend beyond one laboratory. We scientists are trying to discover the story of truth, like what's really out there. Here, so we have no idea. We have no idea. Okay.